Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and a brand new video. Today I've got this CMN Android tablet. I found this old Android tablet lurking around in a drawer and yes I turned it on and I forgot the password. So I'm going to show you guys a step by step instruction on how to reset this back to its factory settings. So stay tuned. Welcome back to return of subscribers and if you're new, you know what to do, please subscribe, don't forget to hit that bell button to stay updated on all my new uploads too. Now the instructions on the internet about the CNN tablet states that you should be pressing the volume plus button, then plugging in the charger and then when you come up to the Android logo, pressing the volume plus and the power button, all these type of options did not work. I went through so many processes and combinations and it did not reset this to factory setting. But I did come across a certain way. Now the only steps I found that worked was these steps right now. So what I'm going to do is press and hold the volume down and the power button at the same time. So I'm going to hold them for around about five seconds. Until you see the logo and then let go. Okay, that's a bit longer, around about 10 seconds. When it boots up, it should come up to a menu. And on this menu, you'll see that some writing, which obviously the English like me, you can't understand. So being as it looks like it's in Mandarin Chinese, I'm just gonna select the options which works for me. So if you'd like to follow at your own risk, this really does work though. It will reset your tablet. So what we're going to do is press number two. Now some tablets may be different and it may have different options. Some have four or three options, this one's got five. But if your tablet's different and you don't know which one to press, well simply press the one that's more familiar to this one here. This option here. Go ahead and press this green little symbol at the bottom. Then go ahead and press it again. And once again we're greeted with more options. These are numbered once again from one to 19. But well, we're gonna go ahead and choose number two again. And again, your tablet may be different than this one. It might have more options or less. But what we're going to do is gonna choose the option with the two logos. And if you can understand the language, well then you'll understand what the option I'm taking. But I'm gonna go ahead and press it. And now the tablet should shut down. And when it does, wait for around about 10 seconds and simply press the power on button and let it start up. This Android logo should run for about one to two minutes and then after that, it should be factory reset. And as you can see, the tablet has now reset and you'll see the factory settings when I first bought this a few years ago. It says make yourself at home, you can put your favourite apps here and everything should be back to normal with the exclusion to any updates which you'll want to do right away. But as for now, everything seems to be working fine and everything is back to the way it was. Now if you've got a frozen screen and it's unresponsive then please play the next video on my channel. It's a total different method and it's real easy to do. I'll leave a link in the description of that video and if you'd like to know how to reset a Samsung if your screen is also frozen without losing any data then hopefully that video will also be useful to you too. But anyway guys I hope this video helps and don't forget please share, please smash that like button, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit that bell option to stay updated on all my new uploads. Thanks for watching. Peace. But I'm going to press uh, number two. Oh no. F Smash it on the f table.